For mom and pop shops to large companies, the businesses in our city continue to be a vital part of what makes St. Paul a great place to live and work. Once a year, we recognize the best with the St. Paul Business Awards. Nominations are accepted in five categories, and the winners are chosen by a committee made up of fellow business owners who are also past winners. We are proud to announce the winners of the 2023 St. Paul Business Awards. Connie's Creamy Cone receives the Traditions Award for a business that has been active for at least 20 years. Owners Jeff and Molly Audette purchased the iconic North End ice cream shop from original owner Connie McCullough three years ago. The Dale Street Institution's claim to fame is offering soft serve in 24 unique flavors, such as Irish cream, mango, and pina colada. Jeff and Molly take pride in giving local youth their first job and also working with the St. Paul Police and Fire to promote a safe neighborhood. Wildflower Coffee wins the New Kid on the Block Award for a business less than five years old. More than just a great neighborhood coffee shop, Wildflyer exists to employ youth experiencing homelessness. All baristas at this WEF 7th location are part of a four-month work and life skills training program and are young people ages 16 to 24. Owner Carly Kammerer is a former social worker who created Wildflyer as a youth-led jobs program. Carly has been honored as one of the Minneapolis St. Paul Business Journal's 40 Under 40 and given Women's Ventures Social Entrepreneur of the Year Award. Down West 7th, a few blocks from Wildflyer, Dabbler Depot is given the Good Neighbor Award. Dabbler Depot is a liquor store, although a very non-traditional one. Not many liquor stores have a podcast studio and a YouTube channel focused on craft beverages, cooking, and more. Dabbler Depot prides itself on selling a high quality and hard to find selection of wines, craft beers, and spirits. Owner Matt Kennevin is a good neighbor who organizes food and clothing drives and helps plows his neighbor's driveways with his skid steer. Dabbler Depot also donates brewing scholarships to LGBTQ and BIPOC entrepreneurs. The Alice O'Brien Award honors a women-owned business committed to equity. Kelsey Josen and company In Control are this year's honoree. In Control provides equitable wellness services to adults with disabilities. Through personalized and in-home programs, In Control empowers clients to achieve goals and take control of their wellness journey. A team of highly trained coaches work with individuals and families to help adults with disabilities live full and independent lives. In Control strives to provide services that respect and honor diverse traditions and perspectives. Longtime East 7th coffee shop Swede Hollow Cafe has been honored with the People's Choice Award. Owners Shirley Yang and Tu and Mary Tao acquired the business in 2020 and strive to continue the tradition of this East Side gem. Known as St. Paul's Gathering Space, Swede Hollow Cafe hosts public and private groups. The cafe are longtime members of the East Side Area Business Association and visit St. Paul. The cafe's patio area is home to a beautiful garden created by nearby youth leadership organization, Urban Roots. The St. Paul City Council produces the business awards and is proud to honor these assets to the community. Join us in showing your support by shopping at these and all locally owned St. Paul businesses.